thing about human mercy is that you can be doing this for so long without the hand of God in this. This is clearly a ministry that she's championed for so many years and God is continuing to use her as a blessing to our generation. Amen. Oh, I mean, sure, oh, 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 Hey, yeah, Mimi, if I'm passing by Makati Hill now, a brewery, Pediasi, you know, Saturday morning, people are moving, jogging, jogging. Now, I'm mm -hmm. increasing volume. No, when you know, I'm going to say, Kosi, sir. I, oh my God, yo. <laughs> okay, this is a, a, a prophetic uh, song. Yeah. That speaks about the mind of God. The mind of God. Um, concerning his people. Mm. And I believe that it's a covenant song i think we released it somewhere 2012 mm -hmm. and it's really had a lot of impact is it your biggest song yet yes yes is that your biggest song one of the biggest mm. which is one your of biggest the song? biggest based on the number of views the commercial value and all the other things which one i think all of them but um me would me would who free mm. um edin jesus Fair, fair, yeah, fair. Jesus is equally wow, wow. You have a lot of songs, though. Yes, that's true. God has blessed you. Amen. But let's talk about this new one. This is a theme for Tehila. I'm telling you. Tehila experience. <laughs> what? Oiva. Yes, darling. Tell us about it. Tehila experience is a form of worship that um, you don't normally do that normal worship that we always go to church and sometimes it becomes so much distracting. And then we pick up our phone and then we'll be listening to calls while worship is going on. Mm. This one is you. You don't really care about your environment, what is going on, but you you go into a business time with the Lord that you know that at the end of the, this worship, I'm, I'm having a miracle. At the end of this worship, God is going to visit me in a special way. Mm. So Tahila experience has really made a lot of impact. Mm -hmm. I think we are in the seventh... Um, seventh? We do in the seventh edition. Wow. Seventh year. And God has really blessed us so much. We have people coming all the way from other countries. And, and it's not uh, that ordinary, um, what do you call it, uh, worship anymore. Mm -hmm. um, this one is, is giving people assurance that when I even come to the... Um, your lowest point in life. Not even that. When I even touch the ground, mm. only God would change something around me. God uh, would do something in my life. Mm. So we have a lot of testimonies out of Tahiti. Let's talk about one of the testimonies. Because I was me, I was testimony. I testimony. Okay, I know of a lady. No, I was saying. So she flew all the way from Germany. Um, with, thank, thank you. Thank you so much. With your friend, we know. Cocktail. This is tehile, nice. Tequila Experimento. Hey! Jojo. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. So it's very mild. No, no alcohol. No. Just. Ah! This is really nice. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So you're telling us about this lady who came from... Yes. So, um... She came and the, her main reason was to worship and to go home with a miracle. Mm. So she went back to Germany and after three months, we, uh, we heard that she's pregnant and she shared her testimony. I know most of the people that are watching us right now will be the best people to share their testimony, especially those that have witnessed the healing experience mm -hmm. for all these years. It's been miracle. How did the how miracles. did that yeah the vision come to you? I remember, saying, I remember I was going to um from Virginia to California. I was in a plane mostly. Yeah, I met you at the airport. Oh boy. Mostly mostly I meditate a lot in the plane and then I had this revelation that um, I've done a lot for Christ. We've done prison ministry, we've done a lot. Yeah. And there is one thing that I need to do to cook food for the Lord and that is to worship mm -hmm. it is a very deep yeah. revelation yeah. and so we I think somewhere 2013 we did the first edition and I think the next day was 6 um, June or something 
And amazingly, it was Thursday and National Theatre was full. Mm -hmm. And we realized that people are so thirsty um, for worship. So we have to hold on, prepare it very well. And then some, we, we took off somewhere 2015. And up till now, it's been on and on. And the reason why you see Taila experience keep on increasing is the testimonies mm. that people go home with. And then when they are coming, also feel like bringing people that are going through a lot of battles mm. to come and have their, um, their, their, their freedom. Wow. Uh, uh, today, today, I would love to hear some folks uh, on uh, our social media pages, especially Facebook, mm -hmm. uh, uh, drop some of the experiences with Tahila if you've ever been part of it before. It would be lovely. I would love to read some of your comments for or, or, or Hima. She would love to hear this as well. Mm. And uh, uh, a big shout going out. Wow, quite a number of them are on. Please share the link and let's experience it. So it's 8th of August. It's it's coming on the 8th of August. Next at exactly, weekend. Yes, at exactly 4 p.m. Mostly when it comes to the atmosphere of Tahila, um, people come all the way from other regions so they come to church okay worship wait mm -hmm. so we are done with Tahila experience mm -hmm. so eight so of, uh, two probably the whole place is full yeah four o'clock we, we take off wow and Do you have I, some of your friends supporting you this year yes this year we we bring in two artists from um america okay. phil thompson oh phil thompson yes the the worship guy yes it was a song that, very powerful yeah i love this this song is so much. my worship yeah all of my worship. <laughs> Sorry. Nail down. <laughs> sorry, sorry, guys. Let me say a question. Sorry. And then we're also having um, um, Michael Stucky. Yeah. And then we also have. Um, Prosper from Nigeria. The guy who sang the Nollywood horror movie soundtrack. No. Eku <laughs> Eme. Ah. Oh, you are the living God. Oh, like you. Who knows a while away? Mommy strings. F F F F sharp. You are the living God. Mommy G in its A G G sharp. Okay, I know uh. this is Joe. <laughs> That's your signature. And then we also have um, um, myself, Sissy Chum, mm. Obapa Christie, MOG, and then my son, Francis Amo. Francis Amo. And Uncle Atu is also one. Oh, the Uncle Atu, Uncle Atu, uh, by the fireside. Hey, un sorry, Uncle Atu's song, the, the one you like. No. Mensuro. No, continue. I only know one word. So continue from there for me. So we, we just want to take this opportunity yeah. to invite everyone to 2021 Tahila experience. And I must confess to you that you are going home yeah. with a testimony. Last year it couldn't happen. I know yes, for obvious because reasons. Because of the COVID yeah. season. But this time it's reloaded even for better. Very, very. Are you worried about the new phase of COVID? No, 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 no. Because we plan it right from January because we know um, that that is the season that we are in so we put down all the uh, covid protocols we're going to observe everything strictly and everybody that is coming should be assured mm. that you are coming at the environment where you you never be the same because like that. we we put in everything everybody is going to be very very comfortable okay precious hope uh pedita odro fanel nazi nana ajua bimpong amwaku joel uh, Gifty, Essie, Kofi, Kweku, Amwaku, yeah, Rebecca, Deborah, all of you. I was asking for your Tahila experience, but all I'm seeing is the comment section of Giovanni. We jale, me jale, me Yeah, some more. I'm hoping to see your testimonies. Why are you insulting me? Anyway, so uh, you've been a teacher before. Yes. And today we've had this kid that's been training. Well, not just today, throughout yesterday and today. Uh, Amazing, I've, I've, I've seen it on social media and I was asking a lot of questions. Yeah. And then I, I have to take my time to read. And understand the story. And understand the story. And I got to know that that child was actually speaking prophetically. Wow. And then it came to pass. Mm -hmm. It's not that people have to go 
and then donate. But it was, it was timely that the child knew that uh, there is something called promise mm -hmm. and fulfillment. If we have the picture of the family or the, 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 the young man also, we can project that on the screen whilst or he might tell us about, about this. And he and also, you know, the yeah. child with this one is teaching our, uh, all of us, mm. especially the parents, mm -hmm. that when you promise a child <laughs> that you, when the child passes yeah. his or her exam, exam. you're going to fulfill it. You need to do it. But this child is a blessed he's, child. He's a unique one. Very, very blessed wow. child. And I know that it is in the book of Jehovah mm -hmm. that that child is going to be a prominent person in this wow, country. Wow, that's beautiful. We have the picture projected on the screen right now. That's also the parents, the mom, the dad. Mm -hmm. And he's holding the mom accountable. The dad too has been busy running around to make sure that all this and bless But when so the much. blessing came, the father was also Yeah, yeah the, dad, the dad is also super. Yeah. We, we are so happy that social media is showing them so much love mm -hmm. and all that. I know my team and behind the scenes. I also want to bless mm -hmm. the teacher. The teacher as well, she, uh, Mrs. She Sophia, or huh? he, okay, she yeah. has really had a lot of impact on that child. Wow, that's mm -hmm. beautiful. Yes. And teaching is a calling, eh? Very, very. So if it's a calling, I why did you stop? To me, so why did you stop? I stopped because of the ministry, because I have to be traveling. Was another calling. But even right, right from the classroom, coming out of the classroom, I'm still teaching. Because I have lots of um, young ladies and uh, guys coming to me. For direction so like i'm still that. teaching so you're still teaching yes i love it and this ministry is also teaching you teach very, the word very, of god very. you have this uh, worship segment you do so well mm -hmm. and a lot of people have been talking about it you That's invite it. all your friends over and just live on social media mm -hmm. you, no time bound you just go all out that's true that's a blessing it's, it's unique blessing. as well it's how a did blessing. that come by um it came i think somewhere last was it last year we, yeah. we were planning about it so Early this year, somewhere April, I called all my sons and daughters that we have to do living room experience. Living room experience? Yes. Where a mother and daughters and sons, we sit down and then we worship to Jehovah. Yeah. And I must confess, I, didn't, I wasn't even expecting that it's going to catch fire. It's like gone viral. It went very, very viral. Mm. And then we're planning to actually do a lot. Wow. Uh, what's the date again for the Tahila experience? And I have, then I have the a date venue? for you. You do? Yes. Oh, stop it. Please bring it. Yes! Pray. Da, 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 da. Oh, hey! Media! Whoa, where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Oh. So on the album of Udin, Udin. Yes, you, you, the, even the bag is really yeah, nice. Yeah, this is beautiful. And then the Timohima Messi wants to give you your Wow, this is beautiful. Invi Guys. Watch me rock this like the leopard and alligator I am. I love it. <laughs> and wow, then we also have another one. Oh, please bring more. Come on, stop it. Oh, stop it. Oh, my mom said I shouldn't be taking things from... Oh, Rahima. Oh, thank you. God bless you. Oh. Thank you so much. Bless you. Thank you, Team Onga. Ilelei! Thank you. A lot of you don't know, but Ilelei is actually, there is a meaning to it. There is a meaning to Ilelei. It means see you on the 8th of August at the Hila Springs. Thank you Thank so you much. Thank you so much. We'll be right back after the break. Stay on! Where are you?